everyone and welcome to the first ever Kegs and Issues here at the Portland House of Music. Sitting here with CEO of the Portland Regional Chamber of Commerce, Quincy Hensel, and creator of Kegs and Issues. Congrats. Sold out event. Sold out event. We are celebrating our first inaugural Kegs and Issues today at the Portland House of Music and we have about 250 attendees. So for many years we've attended, I've attended um, Eggs and Issues, which is in the morning. Is it a similar style? Kegs and Issues is a similar format to Eggs and Issues. There's going to be time for networking, there's going to be an MC, there's going to be a shorter presentation than we typically have at Eggs and Issues, but we're really trying to get to a younger demographic is really our goal. There was a lot of excitement in the community about it when it started to kind of roll out and get out there that we were doing kegs and issues. We're really excited to really start doing different things, highlighting different speakers, and just celebrating our community. And so officially you've been in this role um, for a short time, but doing obviously great things. How's it going? I am loving it. I am absolutely loving it. I love Portland. I love the region. I love the opportunities that this organization gives us to really impact and make change in Portland in the region so so far I'm having a lot of fun good well thank you for having us we'll now show our viewers uh, what they can expect tonight and the next one is in December 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 11th put it on your calendar thank you thank you Well, I, I'm the CEO of our firm, Bernstein Schur. We're really excited about this event. You know, we've been following and participating in Eggs and Issues for many years, and this is just a really cool new version of that, to do it in the evening and to do it as Kegs and Issues. There's a lot of really cool things happening with small businesses, and the food and beverage sector is a really good example of that. So all of the growth in restaurants, in food production, in farm-to-table, breweries, in distilleries, it's all kind of happening in a lot of these very small companies that are just getting on their feet and then growing. And so we, we do a lot of work with those small companies to help them. And it's a lot of fun to see them grow, be a part of it.